and welcome back to my channel. My name is Blonde Shepherd. I'm a performer and I make videos on everything to do with this industry. Okay, so today I thought I'd do like a kind of what I'm doing at home, stay active, motivated, fit, and like what I eat as well. I honestly don't eat anything particular, like I don't have any like mad diet, I just eat everything. And also I'm gonna do some like dance training and stuff today. So I just wanted to show you kind of sort of like my setup right now, like what I've managed to do to get a bit of space. So like yesterday I recorded a tap like audition video and honestly like uh, I don't know, I feel like I was so dumb about it because I am quite a confident tapper, right? And when it, I saw the audition online, I was like, that's fine. I was with it a bit of tap, it's not a big deal. <laughs> and I literally left it until honestly the last day to do it, to record it. And then I actually recorded something that like, honest to God, like full like disclosure, like being honest, I wasn't happy with it. And then I'm like really disappointed with myself today. I'm kind of like, why did I do that? Anyway, you live and you learn, whatever. Yeah, but today I am gonna do a tap half then, and yeah, that's just basically kind of my plan so far for today. I don't really know what else I'll do. So I'll just show you what I'm having for breakfast, and I'm gonna go eat my breakfast now. So for breakfast, I'm just having some vegan yogurt, some passion fruit, and like an orange, like you know these little oranges. I'll probably eat that as well, and that. And I'll probably have something else after this. Because this is like a really tiny bowl. It's like, that's my hand. This is like a very tiny bowl. So I'm having some more food. I'm having like rice cakes with peanut butter and banana. So I just have this, this one, organic peanut butter. Um, I put a bit of extra salt on it. It's pink Himalayan salt. And I think I'll put some of this on it as well. So a bit of cinnamon. So I love cinnamon and of course I have my big standard bucket of tea. Okay, so new plan, I just got dressed because I am gonna go to the shops and basically I'm gonna go get a plant, like an indoor plant. Um, yeah, like I really wanted a plant. I wanted something to like look after and nurture and I just like the look of them. I think they're like nice and they're supposed to like filter the air and all this. Try and eat this really fast and then go out and like honestly like I don't leave the house like I literally don't but yeah like I literally like never have a reason to leave the house unless it's for a walk to get a coffee or something like really simple so <laughs> I get really excited when I actually have to go do something I think I'm happy with this one, like it's like about 50 quid, full length, and it also has like a thing on the back. We have a winner. Trying to take the mirror home. I have it in like the back of the boot, the seat down. So this is the room that I emptied out basically. I just took the carpet up. I have these on the floor so I can tap. And then I literally just bought this, as you saw, a mirror and it actually makes it look so much nicer. So like when you come in, it's like this plant, just giving the room a bit of life. And I actually got something else, I'm not gonna go get it and show you, which is gonna make it really nice. So this is the other thing I got, it's like lemongrass and cedar wood, it smells so nice. And it's from the Kilkenny shop in town. It's so nice, it smells really good. It's like a real like spa kind of smell, it's so nice. That'll do, 
and the fireplace it should give like the real nice smell as well because <laughs> i'm like sweating it out and dancing this is all like my dancing shoes all of that this is from the stereo i've been using that as a tripod because i need to get a tripod and then this is i've had people ask me about this this is a gorilla joby tripod gorilla tripod yeah joby that's what that is i just bought that for like uh, making vlogs and all of that yeah, I think I'm gonna get like a sponge, I'm gonna get the hoover out, like clean the like skirtings and stuff. I don't wanna clean the fireplace and I would like to mop the floors. I don't know if I'll do that today, but I wanna hoover anyway. So I'm gonna get all that done now. So I'm feeling a little bit peckish, so I'm just gonna make a quick coffee and have a little snack, but um, I don't want to eat too much because I just want to clean that room really quickly, do the hoovering, I'll hoover the whole house, and then I want to get stuck into a workout. Yeah, I'll see how I go. But yeah, I'm just going to have a quick snack now. So I decided just to have this instant coffee and some bourbon creams. They're super cheap, so they're just the ones, the go-to ones. Yeah, I just kind of want a bit of sugar. I've now sugar in this, so I'm going to have a biscuit. I'm absolutely obsessed with naked bars, but they're quite expensive and my situation at the moment I don't really feel like splashing out on like loads of like really 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 like expensive super healthy things and also like I don't really feel like it's that necessary to eat like super super clean like I find that like having a really good balance is the best thing and gives the best results and like honestly if I am being real straight to myself and I'm being like I can't eat anything I'm not gonna eat any chocolate like I just get really sad then so um and I get burnt out from doing that as well so yeah I just keep a good balance and I just eat whatever I feel really I definitely used to when I was younger I definitely used to like track everything like track all the calories that were in everything and like I'd log everything into my fitness pal I had like a personal trainer and like I got really good results and I was really happy with my body but I also became like quite like psychotic about it like I remember like trying to like I was single at the time and I was like trying to date someone and I just remember being like I don't want to like go out for food or them. I don't want to do this I don't want to do that and like it really like limited everything that I could do and I was happy with my body like I actually was I was in certain few photos of like what it was like what my body was like I don't know then I remember moving to London this is like just after college kind of thing and this is like it was all in my head it was all like I had to have like this perfect body to like get employed and I had like yeah I just had all these like beliefs in my head that weren't really true and I remember moving over to London I was living with my friend Natalia and she just was like what's wrong with you like I remember we got like a Mars bar or something from our like flatmates and I was like oh you can have mine like I just didn't want to eat it I didn't want to eat anything that wasn't like anything that was refined sugar like I just didn't want to eat that um yeah anything that was like normal like anything that was kind of like bad food i just like didn't want to eat that and i was like really 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 strict about it and she was like just eat the thing and i was kind of like oh and like she really made me see that i was like gone too far so um thanks for that and to tell you it, i just feel like a balance is kind of easy having a filter coffee and a and a banoffee pie fruit and a bar okay so i'm just rolling out my calf now because basically what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do a workout but i think i'm gonna put my character heels on because basically i feel like it's such a different set of muscles that you're working when you're in your character heels so I have this theory that if I do a workout with heels on, it's going to strengthen them. I mean, in my mind it makes sense, I don't actually know if it'll translate into dancing, I'm not really sure. But I thought, I'll give it a go and I know that my calves will be in bits after, so like I'll probably like massage them out after. But I'm just going to like roll them out now before I get going. I took a lot of my inspiration for this off Rhonda Malkin, who's a teacher in the university whose class I did like two months ago for a month, three months ago maybe now. It was at the start of lockdown. 
and yeah so she does a thing called fusion heels and um, so I did that for a bit yeah I had my dinner there I spent quite a lot of time on my phone on Instagram um, I was just cleaning up but I was on the phone chatting to my friend and yeah just kind of getting like bits and bobs done kind of sort of thing so I'm gonna put on the second Mamma Mia Mamma Mia here we go again on Netflix and <laughs> I'm gonna do workout. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so I'm just gonna have a quick snack on one of these vegan burgers. I'm just gonna eat it on its own. I'm like so bad for snacking, so that's what I'ma do. So I just did my workout. So my <laughs> my hair is a bit disgraceful. Mmm. But basically, I'm gonna have a quick snack now. So I thought I, I said I would show you what I'm eating today. So it's just these salt and vinegar snacker jackers. Right, so I just rolled up the carpet like this, and under the carpet I have these <coughs> wooden planks, so I can tap on them and not ruin the floor. By the way, I've been drinking loads of water today. I try and drink as much as I can every day. So this is maybe my fourth. Yeah, probably my fourth one. So I'm still dancing away, but I'm just gonna have a quick snack of some broccoli. I'm still hungry, so I'm gonna have another burger and put some sriracha sauce on it. And by the way, this is like a vegan burger that I'm eating here. It's such a struggle because this is like a recorded class uh, that I'm trying to do. And it's just a big struggle like this. Like, it keeps freezing and I don't really know what's going on. It's really pixelated. So I keep having to like pause it and I have to like listen to her do it, pause it and then try and do it. Like I can't do it at the same time because I don't hear her over like how loud my taps are. So it's a bit of a struggle. But it's alright, I'm getting through it. <laughs> so I just finished doing the tap class there and it was literally like so difficult to like make out what was going on because it was just like all pixelated and it kept freezing with the wi-fi and stuff but i'm gonna try it again tomorrow because my brain is just a bit exhausted from being like what is going on and then figuring it out on my own kind of thing but yeah do let me know any other videos as well if you want any other videos done like if there's anything like i can put out there that would help someone like that's what this channel is all about, it's just like, like sharing information, like that's literally why I made this channel. Like back in the day when I graduated and I made it to London, I just feel like I felt like the only one that was going through certain emotions or like, like I just felt like there was nowhere to find information or like I wanted to know like what other performers are doing and there's just like no one with a YouTube channel. And um, yeah, and like now, like still now, like there still kind of isn't like, um, but yeah. Um, so I just kind of wanted to create something for you, for like anyone out there who's like, oh, what am I doing? Like that needs kind of someone else to kind of vibe off. Like um, I thought it would be good to make like a really cool community where we can just kind of help each other out. And I have got some video ideas for like how to help each other. I've got some good video ideas that I think will help. And um, I've kind of avoided doing them because obviously right now we're not auditioning that much and blah, blah, blah. Uh, so I feel like they're not relevant, but I think I might do them because they might be relevant in the future and stuff. But yeah, make sure you do share this channel as well with your friends. Like. If yeah, I think I'm literally just gonna like edit for the rest of the day, watch a bit of Netflix, um, I'm not really sure <laughs> what I'm gonna do, but um, I'm definitely gonna have a shower anyway, and might even have a nice little drink. But yeah, that's it now for my dancing and all of that. I'm delighted with what I've done with this room, by the way. Like, I'm so happy because, like, this room, like, I didn't ever show it on social media, I think, before. I kind of like stripped it because it was like my family room like it was like had like a stereo in it a few like armchairs like we just kind of chilled out here more in the winter because we have a fireplace here so now that's the kind of the summer like no one's kind of using this room 
So like I, I've been I've been given permission to like strip it and turn it into a bit of a studio. But yeah, like my parents are like so good that way. Like they're literally just like yeah, do whatever. But um yeah, they're so good. I'm just having some more crisps, some sour cream and chai flavor snacker jacks, and a non-alcoholic IPA. So that is literally it for this video. If you've liked this, please do hit the subscribe button and hit that like button as it re-supports my channel. And if you have any other videos that you want to see, like comment below. I'll definitely get around to making that at some point. So do let me know what you'd like to see. And just to finish, finish oh, and just to finish off the day of eating, I'm now gonna finish the day with a glass of wine. I really feel like I deserve it, and I'm just gonna like enjoy a bit of Netflix and chill. I feel like every day I'm getting up. I'm just trying to keep myself happy, keep my head steady. Like I'm not trying to worry too much about the future. So like every day, at the end of every day, I'm going, what do I want to do tomorrow? Try and pick like three things basically, and like. For me, even tomorrow morning, I want to get up, I want to do a bit of a workout, a bit of a stretch, more of a stretch tomorrow, then like finish off the task that I was doing today, and then I want to see, I'm going to try and see like three or two of my friends tomorrow. So yeah, like just trying to get like a little something done every day, keep chipping away, what can you do? But yeah, like with what I eat as well, like I don't really follow any like strict eating habits or like strict diets or anything like that. I try and just eat when I'm hungry, like food as fuel, all that sort of stuff. Um, and yeah, I guess I try to be as healthy as I can, but I'm obviously gonna have my mind as well. Like with what is healthy, like that's such a like personal opinion. So um, I guess that's my like version of healthy. Like I think it's fine to have a biscuit or a pack of crisps or a glass of wine, like. I'm like that's fine um for me so it's like different for everyone but yeah so that's that for today if you have enjoyed this please do subscribe it really supports my channel and until next time bye